How can I do the will of God? Is it possible to live in heaven while here on earth? These two questions have been in my mind for a long time. While doing my prayers, I started posing these questions to the Lord. And then he said to me, My will is not something that will come as black and white into your mind. I speak for my Holy Spirit in very varied and subtle ways that are not picked up right away, but rather will become the thoughts and desires of the soul in such a way that eventually it will do my will if it wants to, or perhaps not. When something is good, it is my call on the soul to do it. I have already expressed my desires through all the commandments to keep them is a sign of the soul's desire to do my will. When you do my holy will, you will experience great peace. You will feel useful. You will desire to do more for me. You will be filled with joy. Your desires will be united to mine, and you will feel my presence in your heart continually. When you rest in my presence, you have a share in everything that I have, my peace, my love, my joy, and all my perfections. The more you do my will, the more intense will be my kingdom in your heart. You see, I have taught you to pray for the coming of my kingdom and for my will to be done on earth as it is in heaven. That is, to be done in you as it is done in me. When you follow the promptings of the Holy Spirit, you are doing exactly that. And what is the reward of the soul for doing my will? My will is the true holiness that you must find, to be holy and live eternally. It is the will of the Father, because in that will is my kingdom, which united to my will is my greatest desire. It is the objective of my coming to the world to establish that kingdom for the salvation of souls and for the glory of the Holy Trinity. Those who resist my will, on the contrary, and live by their own desires, shut the door to my kingdom and make me keep struggling to save them. The soul that does my will becomes a little heaven for me, an oasis of love and peace. I want to rest in that soul because I am truly glorified since that soul lives in my presence and conforms to my divine will. When you do my holy will, you become my little heaven on earth and I become yours in that way that makes it truly possible for you to live in heaven while you are here on earth. In my heaven, you will have everything that you need and you will fulfill not only your desires, but mine. And I have to answer that question that you have in your heart. What about my sufferings? These don't exist in heaven. Let me tell you that when you conform to my divine will, sufferings will be a true joy, because you will be imitating me, your Savior, who suffered for your sins. In fact, your sufferings united to mine will obtain the grace for many souls to achieve their salvation. The reality is that the soul who does my will becomes, like me, another Jesus, another Savior, and for this reason will have the same desires as mine. So there is no point in going to heaven yet, when you can have it here on earth in my presence, and you can be useful and do the same works that I did. Having the throne of my divine will in your heart makes you an extension of my being, and that is my glory and the glory of heaven.